Hey guys, what's up? Thanks for tuning in to Vast Eye View. Uh, I just wanted to do these little instructional videos because I had a heck of a time getting this down. And um, I've been trying to pass these missions since uh, Battlefront 2 came out. But I finally did it yesterday and I just wanted to document this and um, see if I could help you guys pass this real quick. Okay, so the one thing, uh, number one thing you gotta realize about every one of these uh, battle scenarios is the they're always in a pattern. They're always going to be in a pattern. The the stormtroopers come at you in a pattern, and you got to find the best way to get them to come at you and kill them while avoiding blasters, uh, blaster fire. Um, so I'm running back here to get out of the blaster fire um, and waiting for them to get come up to me in clumps. And that way you can take them out and hopefully not get killed. So you've got to watch your health and you got to watch the blaster fire and get away from it. Like I'm almost dead here, so I run away. You can see I'm down to two people. This is very irritating. Because I got down to two people and blaster fire. Because I took a chance. Can't take the chance. If you got time on the clock, be patient. Wait for the opportunity. Wait for them to come to you. Okay, so as you can see, there's, I have a pattern. Uh, I always run over on this side. I used to run straight up the stairs and go straight at them. But I always got killed. So I got to where I ran around this side. Sometimes I can get some stray troopers and take them out. Um... And you gotta be careful about these guys, the ones that are way away, that are shooting at you from a distance. You try to go after them and shoot them, somebody's gonna get you uh, from, a, from a distance as well. So this guy was down here all by himself, so I thought, well, I'll go get him while, these other, while I let these other troopers clump up. Gain a little health back. So here we go, so this guy comes in kind of by himself, which is dangerous. Uh, but I did manage to go out and get these guys. Those other guys coming at me, were, I was tempted to go after, but you, you got time on the clock. You got 40 seconds, and you still got eight troopers to go. You can't risk the health. See how my health's going back up? Give it a chance. Uh, let them come. Let them be stupid, not you. So that guy uh, started spawning through the wall there. Um, anyway, so here we go. I get down to one kill left, and I get killed. Yeah. Had plenty of time on the clock. The guy snuck up on the stairs on me. Took me out. <clears throat> so, I just wanted you guys to see that I did fail a couple of times. But that this pattern does work for me. Might not work for you, but it worked for me. Uh, but here we go. Everything's going well this time. The one thing is you gotta be patient. And you gotta let them be stupid, like I said. That guy came by himself, he's far enough away, I had enough health, I figured, go ahead. Okay, so you can see how they're clumping up now. Give it a little time, let them come into you once again. Go out and get the strays real quick and get back. Give yourself, you have 40, I had 48 seconds here, I got the stray coming at me. Gotta watch the guys coming down the steps, but I figure, go get him. I only got seven guys left. There's a huge clump of guys up there. I'm bound to be able to get this. I almost got stupid right here. Nope. If I would have kept running up the steps, I would have been dead. Thankfully, I went in here, and these guys are spread far enough apart. I was able to single them out. Get it knocked down. As you can see right here, last one done. Anyway, I hope this helps you guys. If you liked the video, make sure you uh, hit the like and subscribe. I will be doing more instructional videos on how to do these battle scenarios. So, see you in the future. Thanks for tuning in.